Hey, it's The Average Dan, and we just wrapped up another day of work on the 1984 Fleetwood Wilderness 24-foot camper uh, that we purchased, used, obviously. Uh, it was in need of a lot of work, and uh, we've made a ton of progress, and uh, we are heading towards the uh, final home stretch. Uh, so I want to show you what we did so far and what's left to be done. So I'm going to flip the camera around and let you take a look. All right, so in our previous video, we had begun to do the floor. The floor, we went with uh, adhesive vinyl tiles. Um, it's a an affordable flooring option. Uh, it's a lot uh, quicker and easier to put down than some of the other flooring options. Uh, since we are kind of focused on trying to do the best we can without spending a fortune, uh, I think these turned out well. So I'm going to flip around and show you the finished product here. As you can see, I think it looks pretty nice. Now I had also mentioned that we were working on that custom bed frame, um, and I'm happy, I'm thrilled to say that it's finally done. Um, it has actually been built for uh, a few days now, but we had to finish the flooring before we could get that in there in here. We went with a, a six inch memory foam mattress that we picked up on Amazon. We just unwrapped it, um, so it's still kind of uh, working on re-expanding. They say it takes up to 48 hours for it to get back to its full shape. But uh, when we take a look around and we compare it to what everything looked like in the original video, I think we see a vast improvement um, for really not a ton of money. We're probably into this. Oh... $300 maybe? I'll try to work up the actual figures when we uh, are finally, finally done. Um, but this may be kind of a, a labor of love that we continually tweak. But all in all, I think uh, I, I think the change that, uh, that we've achieved so far is pretty significant. It went from uh, a room you really didn't want to stay in for more than five minutes uh, we still got to put hardware up on these and uh, doors down here. Um, there's going to be cabinets in there. They're going to have matching hardware to those. This area fits a dog crate that we can slide in there on trips for our two little Chihuahuas, Dubs, and T-Bear. So they can, uh, they'll fit right in there uh, when we sleep at night. Um, and overall, I think... Uh, the floor really does a lot to kind of improve the overall look of the place. And like I said, that cost us maybe $60 for the materials. Uh, the actual, you get 20 per box and they were like $10 and change per box. So I think it, uh, I think it was definitely the right way to go. And um, can't wait to take this thing out. We have a few uh, additional things that we're gonna work on. We have, this is the original um, wallpaper behind the kitchen. If I can show you this here, we're going to replace that with this. Kind of fits our color scheme. So that's gonna go across the walls. This is gonna go across the base of the walls. And then we have some of these which are, um, they're kind of like peel and stick sets that we're going to use to accent the solid wood color um, sections that we painted that that brownish color. So we'll add some some accents around the around the refrigerator and um, these wood pieces here and on the uh, the mattress, the bunks back there to kind of tie everything together. So overall. Um, we have uh, made quite a bit of progress. So I hope you enjoyed checking out some of the uh, progress that we've made. We've really come a long way from a, a trailer that we bought uh, for next to nothing, haven't put a ton of money in it, but uh, I think it's certainly come a long way aesthetically uh, and it uh, it's a couple more steps closer to uh, uh, what we're looking for to, to take out for a long weekend with the family. So. Um, Probably have a couple more videos as we get the finishing touches in here. Uh, please stay with us. If you haven't subscribed, please do. I appreciate it. Please like the video. 
Uh, share your comments, good, bad, or otherwise. And uh, until next time, this is The Average Dan. Thanks.